Hey guys, Dan Sperry here, just uh, back in my hotel room after a show. And the hardest part of being on the road is always trying to eat healthy and avoiding places like McDonald's, um, you know, and the like. Sometimes I try and stop at like a Perkins, gotta love Perkins, or a Cracker Barrel, my favorite if possible. But other times you're kind of stuck. Uh, with wherever your hotel room is and a lot of times it's next to or close to uh, some kind of greasy nasty place or in your rider um, when you're provided with a meal they usually try and bring you pizza or something like that even when it says a fruit tray not saying but I'm just saying so uh, this is my dinner uh, this is uh, my dinner tonight on the road in my hotel room. I went to the grocery store <clears throat> and I got some little turkey wrap ding things. Um, yeah, discounted to uh, 298 So of course got those. For dessert, <clears throat> or a side I should say, these look pretty good too. These little apple slices and you dunk them in the caramel if you like and then you put some granola on it. Try and drink some water after a show, so I got some raspberry water because plain water just tastes like water. And then these kind of are good for a little dessert snack. Raisins, but they're covered in yogurt, so yeah. But the, the problem, though, is usually when you go grocery shopping after a gig, you're already hungry, and then all of a sudden you're trying to be healthy with all this, and then it's like, whoa, where did these sea salt and vinegar kettle chips come from? Because they sure look good. And then, you know, I have this... Uh, Six pack of Bud Light wheat, because I need the brown bottle for the uh, Russian roulette uh, glass trick in the show, so that's why there's one missing there. I like to get something kind of unique and good. I don't try and go for like Coors Light or some nasty uh, beer like that, because I always leave this in the refrigerator when there is a refrigerator. I leave it for the maids as like a like a thank you, and I'm sorry for any mess and bodily fluids that I've left on the walls or carpet. Um, not saying it's happened before, but I'm just saying. And then sometimes, like, out of nowhere, you're trying to really be good, and then it's like, hey, wait a minute. Where did these junior whoopee, <laughs> whoopee pies, whoopee pie, because I'll tell you what, I said whoopee when I saw these puppies. Red velvet with cream cheese icing. on. Look at that. It's like a giant Oreo oh, of goodness. Uh, I don't know where this one went, because I'm a good boy, and I don't eat that before dinner but yeah that's um it's what we're looking at here i got some first 48 going on above in my tv look at this look at this tv stand living the dream living the dream